Hi guys, welcome to another short video by Antiques Arena. My name is Walter O'Neill. In this video I'm going to show you some of my car boot sale finds that I don't didn't buy to sell on, I bought to furnish my home. Um, there's pieces of stone statues, there's some flower pots, um, we have a fairy garden. Um, I, what I'm going to do is give you a little close up um, and give you an idea what you can actually find at the car boot sale. Now I done a video yesterday talking about taking lilies and that to a car boot sale and I was explaining to you how expensive statues and things are. Now there's statues in the uh, our local garden centre for £350 for a small single lion. I have two lions on pedestals here that stand over four feet tall. They come in at a car boot sale for £60. I'd say they're worth anywhere from £700, £800 up. Um, as a cost of replacement. I have two double baskets, one in each corner, that come in for a tenner, and the cost of those is not a million miles off a hundred pounds. Little stones on the floor that uh, have come in for 50 p's and a pound and that, and they're up six, seven, eight pounds. Even the plastic tub over there, we have the herb garden in, um, in the garden centres, they're up 30, 40 pounds. That one came from B&M's or Home Bargains or one of those and it was priced at a tenner but I actually had it off the boot sale for a couple of pounds. So there's ways of buying really nice pieces for your garden and saving the money. So I'm going to give you a little close up of um, some of the pieces. These lions are one of my all time favourite buys. Um, they'll never leave me. I absolutely worship them. They're beautiful. Um, so yeah, I'll give you... Uh, a little look at the bits and bobs now and see what you think. Hope you enjoy guys. Okay, the flowers now are starting to die now in the uh, double baskets, but there's um, there's two of those, one either side. As you can see, we have a variety of stepping stones that I've placed down on the floor, all of which have different animals on, all in, uh, in the moulding. Then we come across a um, couple of ornaments and then you have the flower garden not all the flower gardens come off a car boot sale but a lot of it has then of course we come on to the pieces I absolutely love here we have the lions you see the uh, beautiful crown not sure this symbol looks uh, almost Maltese um, come down the lion almost looks like something off um, bed knobs and broomsticks the memorial spectacular Look at that. I haven't uh, identified the family yet Wow War Memorial and obviously they, I've stood them on pedestals both lions are in wonderful condition nothing wrong with either of them they're stunning I've never had them on display um, this year is the first year I've put them outside they've lived in my garage since I've purchased them And there we have it. I've only got a small front courtyard. My back garden's the size of a football field, but the front, um, as you can see, we have the table and chairs now. We put out along here and have a cup of tea and maybe a sandwich or a bite to eat. And it's just really pretty for the children, um, for us to come out and just relax. It's a nice little spot at the front of the house. It's not the biggest, but at the same time, it's easy to maintain and it's really attractive. As you can see guys, lions, beautiful, um, you can't get better than that. Um, and in the garden centre, as I say, small lions like that with £350. Car boot sale buys, what more do you want? Um, they had other pieces there, but on the day I didn't have a lot of money left. I'd already bought a lot of stock, a lot of gold and silver. Um, I think they cleared a big manor house up in Brecon Way. Um, which is where these came from and yeah they now live with me and I love them so I hope you've uh, enjoyed the uh, film guys if you have uh, please put a like and a share I'd appreciate it uh, don't forget to subscribe I've added a link at the end of the video um, you'll find us on Facebook Antiques Arena you'll find us on eBay Antiques Arena Clearance and we have our own website antiquesarena.co.uk hope you enjoyed guys thanks for watching